What is the meaning of the verb blow out? When a piece of electrical equipment or a fuse blows out. It fails because too much electricity is passing through it. Don't be surprised if the fuse blows out you have seven lights. Your computer, and your TV all plugged into one outlet. What is the meaning of the verb get up? When you change from a sitting or lying position to a standing position, you get up. Stand up is similar to get up. The teacher told the sleeping students to get up. What is the meaning of the verb run up? When you accumulate a number of debts. Resulting in a total debt of a certain amount, you run up a bill for that amount. Calling your family every week from Australia must have run a big phone bill up. What is the meaning of the verb get up, to? When you move to a higher level or place, or from south to north. You get up or get up to that level or place. Get down is the opposite of get up. Go up is similar to get up. I haven't gotten up to my brother's house in Canada for a long time. What is the meaning of the verb get by, on? When you get by or get by on a certain amount of money.
you continue with your work or continue with your life even though it may be difficult. Don't worry about me, I'll get by somehow. What is the meaning of the verb get down? When things or people get you down, they make you sad or depressed. Don't let your troubles get you down. Everything will be alright. What is the meaning of the verb shut up, about, informal? When people stop talking, they shut up or shut up about something they are talking about. When you are angry and want people to stop talking, you tell them to shut up. Marvin talks and talks and talks he never shuts up. What is the meaning of the verb get by, on? When you get by or get by on a certain amount of money. You continue with your work or continue with your life even though it may be difficult. It's not easy getting by on $250 a week. What is the meaning of the verb stop off, Atlan? When you stop off at a place or stop off in an area on the way to another place. You stop there briefly before continuing your journey. L would have stopped off at Sally's house this morning, but I was late for work. What is the meaning of the verb blow out, of?
when something is moved outward away from where it was by an explosion or a very strong wind. It is blown out or blown out of where it was before. Look, there's a dead bird. The wind might have blown it out of its nest. What is the meaning of the verb get down, from? When you get things or people down, you move them from a higher level or place to a lower one. Why do you always put the dishes on the top shelf? I can't get them down. What is the meaning of the verb get up? When you get up or someone gets you up, you rise from your bed. When you get people up, you cause them to rise from their beds. I make breakfast, getting the children up and ready for school in the morning is Bill's job. What is the meaning of the verb run up, to? When you run toward people, you run up or run up to them. The prince didn't have any bodyguards. Anyone could have run up and attacked him. What is the meaning of the verb beat up informal? When you beat people up, you hit them or kick them repeatedly. The mugger stole my money and then beat me up. What is the meaning of the verb get by?
when you get by or get by something, you pass something or someone while you are. Walking or driving even though it may be difficult because there is not enough room. Can you move all that junk in the hallway please? It's hard for people to get by. What is the meaning of the verb get down? When you bend your body and lower your head to avoid. Danger or to prevent people from seeing you, you get down. Get down. If the police catch us here we'll be in a lot of trouble. What is the meaning of the verb run up, to? When you run toward people, you run up or run up to them. After the explosion, a man covered with blood ran up to me and asked for help. What is the meaning of the verb get up? When you get up or someone gets you up, you rise from your bed. When you get people up, you cause them to rise from their beds. L don't usually get up until 11 o'clock on weekends. What is the meaning of the verb blow out, of? When something is moved outward away from where it was by an explosion or a very strong wind. It is blown out or blown out of where it was before. The force of the explosion blew all the windows out.
What is the meaning of the verb get up? When you change from a sitting or lying position to a standing position, you get up. Stand up is similar to get up. After he hit me, I got right up and hit him back. What is the meaning of the verb stop off, Atlan? When you stop off at a place or stop off in an area on the way to another place. You stop there briefly before continuing your journey. Stopping off in Cairo on our way to India would be fun. What is the meaning of the verb try on? When you try on an item of clothing before deciding whether you will buy it or borrow. It from someone in order to see if it fits or to see if you like it, you try it on. She must have tried on 20 pairs of shoes before making up her mind. What is the meaning of the verb get down? When you bend your body and lower your head to avoid. Danger or to prevent people from seeing you, you get down. When the enemy soldiers started shooting, the sergeant ordered his men to get down. What is the meaning of the verb shut up informal? When people or things cause you to stop talking, they shut you up. I can't hear the TV can you shut those kids up?
What is the meaning of the verb get down? When things or people get you down, they make you sad or depressed. Jim's marriage problems are really getting him down. What is the meaning of the verb shut up, about, informal? When people stop talking, they shut up or shut up about something they are talking about. When you are angry and want people to stop talking, you tell them to shut up. I said I was sorry about crashing your car. Now will you please shut up about it? What is the meaning of the verb get up, to? When you move to a higher level or place, or from south to north. You get up or get up to that level or place. Get down is the opposite of get up. Go up is similar to get up. Tom, your brother is in the basement. Please go tell him to get right up here and start doing his homework. What is the meaning of the verb shut up informal? When people or things cause you to stop talking, they shut you up. Toad was making jokes about his wife at the party until she gave him a look that shut him right up. What is the meaning of the verb blow out? When a flame blows out or is blown out by a strong wind, it stops burning.
when you blow out a flame, you use your breath to make the flame stop burning. The stove isn't working. Maybe the pilot light has blown out. What is the meaning of the verb blow out? When a flame blows out or is blown out by a strong wind, it stops burning. When you blow out a flame, you use your breath to make the flame stop burning. Don't open the window the candles will blow out. What is the meaning of the verb get by? When you get by or get by something, you pass something or someone while you are. Walking or driving even though it may be difficult because there is not enough room. There was an accident on the highway, and no one could get by. What is the meaning of the verb get by? When something, such as a mistake or a problem, gets by you, you do not notice it. I checked this report twice. How did all these misspellings get by me? What is the meaning of the verb beat up informal? When you beat people up, you hit them or kick them repeatedly. Timmy got beaten up at school today. What is the meaning of the verb beat up informal? When you beat people up, 
you hit them or kick them repeatedly. Timmy got beaten up at school today. What is the meaning of the verb carry away, with, always passive? When you get carried away or carried. I was going to make a dozen cupcakes for dessert tonight, but I got carried away and ended up making 40. What is the meaning of the verb carry away, with, always passive? When you get carried away or carried. I was going to make a dozen cupcakes for dessert tonight, but I got carried away and ended up making 40. What is the meaning of the verb carry away, with, always passive? When you get carried away or carried. You should always start a new exercise program slowly. If you get carried away with it, you might hurt yourself. What is the meaning of the verb carry away, with, always passive? When you get carried away or carried. You should always start a new exercise program slowly. If you get carried away with it, you might hurt yourself. What is the meaning of the verb kick out, of? Away with something, you do more than is necessary or proper.
because you enjoy it or because you think it is important. David drank too much and got himself kicked out of the bar. What is the meaning of the verb kick out, of? Away with something, you do more than is necessary or proper. Because you enjoy it or because you think it is important. David drank too much and got himself kicked out of the bar. What is the meaning of the verb kick out, of? When you kick people out or kick people out of a group. Place, building, room, and so on, you order them to leave. Throw out is similar to kick out. Bob's in our carpool, but he's always arguing with the other guys about something. So we're going to kick him out. What is the meaning of the verb kick out, of? When you kick people out or kick people out of a group. place, building, room, and so on, you order them to leave. Throw out is similar to kick out. Bob's in our carpool, but he's always arguing with the other guys about something. So we're going to kick him out. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock all the doors and windows of a building, you lock it up.
the manager always locks up before he goes home. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock all the doors and windows of a building, you lock it up. The manager always locks up before he goes home. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock all the doors and windows of a building, you lock it up. We locked our house up before we went on vacation. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock all the doors and windows of a building, you lock it up. We locked our house up before we went on vacation. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock people up, you put them in prison. The police locked Hank up after they caught him shoplifting. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock people up, you put them in prison. The police locked Hank up after they caught him shoplifting. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock people up, you put them in prison. Whoever committed that terrible crime ought to be locked up forever.
What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock people up, you put them in prison. Whoever committed that terrible crime ought to be locked up forever. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix something up that has two or more ingredients. You stir it so that the ingredients will be thoroughly combined. Put in the eggs, butter, sugar, flour, and water and then mix it up well. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix something up that has two or more ingredients. You stir it so that the ingredients will be thoroughly combined. Put in the eggs, butter, sugar, flour, and water and then mix it up well. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix something up that has two or more ingredients. You stir it so that the ingredients will be thoroughly combined. An electric mixer will mix up the ingredients better than a hand mixer. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix something up that has two or more ingredients. You stir it so that the ingredients will be thoroughly combined. An electric mixer will mix up the ingredients better than a hand mixer.
What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix two things up, you confuse them with each other. Jerry and his twin brother look exactly the same, and everyone mixes them up. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix two things up, you confuse them with each other. Jerry and his twin brother look exactly the same, and everyone mixes them up. What is the meaning of the verb head toward? When you head toward a certain location, you move toward it. When you say that you are headed toward or are heading toward a certain location. You mean that you are planning to go there or that you are going there but have interrupted your journey and will resume it. Head for is the same as head toward. The escaped convicts must have headed toward Mexico. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get something in or get something into a place, building, room, container. enclosure, and so on, you get the object inside even though it is difficult. The shoes are too small I can't get my feet in. What is the meaning of the verb give out, to? When you distribute something to other people, you give it out or give it out to them. Hand out is similar to give out.
They gave out free hats to the first 5,000 fans to enter the stadium. What is the meaning of the verb give out, on? When a mechanical or electrical device stops working, it gives out or gives out on you. When a supply of something is completely used, it gives out or gives out on you. I bought a Chevrolet in 1964 and drove it more than 300,000 miles before it finally gave out on me. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, you arrive. When the vehicle you are in gets in or gets into a place, it arrives. Come in is similar to get in. I'm exhausted. I got in really late last night. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock people up, you put them in prison. Whoever committed that terrible crime ought to be locked up forever. What is the meaning of the verb kick out, of? Away with something, you do more than is necessary or proper. Because you enjoy it or because you think it is important. David drank too much and got himself kicked out of the bar. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, building, room, car, boat, and so on, 
you enter it. Get in the car. We're going now. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in trouble or get into a difficult situation or a mess, a eh? mess is a confused or difficult situation, you become involved in it. When you get people in trouble or get them into a difficult situation or a mess. You cause them to become involved in it. I don't see any solution to this problem. How did I ever get into this mess? What is the meaning of the verb run up, to? When you run to a higher level or place, you run up or run up to that place. If I'd heard the baby crying, I would have run up to his bedroom. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix something up that has two or more ingredients. You stir it so that the ingredients will be thoroughly combined. Put in the eggs, butter, sugar, flour, and water and then mix it up well. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock all the doors and windows of a building, you lock it up. The manager always locks up before he goes home.
What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, building, club. Restaurant, meeting, and so on, you obtain permission to enter. When you get other people in or get other people into a building. club, restaurant, meeting, and so on, you arrange for them to enter. L didn't have an invitation to the party, but Nancy got me in. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix two things up, you confuse them with each other. Jerry and his twin brother look exactly the same, and everyone mixes them up. What is the meaning of the verb get in? When a store gets something in, it receives a delivery of something that it will offer for sale. Karen asked the sales clerk when the store was going to get some summer dresses in. What is the meaning of the verb head toward? When you head toward a certain location, you move toward it. When you say that you are headed toward or are heading toward a certain location. You mean that you are planning to go there or that you are going there but have interrupted your journey and will resume it. Head for is the same as head toward. I'm heading toward Portland. Where are you going? What is the meaning of the verb mix up?
when you mix something up that has two or more ingredients. You stir it so that the ingredients will be thoroughly combined. An electric mixer will mix up the ingredients better than a hand mixer. What is the meaning of the verb get in? When a store gets something in, it receives a delivery of something that it will offer for sale. I wanted to buy that new book, but the bookstore hasn't gotten it in yet. What is the meaning of the verb carry away, with, always passive? When you get carried away or carried. I was going to make a dozen cupcakes for dessert tonight, but I got carried away and ended up making 40. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, building, room, car, boat, and so on, you enter it. We'd better get into the school the bell's going to ring soon. What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock all the doors and windows of a building, you lock it up. We locked our house up before we went on vacation. What is the meaning of the verb carry away, with, always passive? When you get carried away or carried. You should always start a new exercise program slowly.
if you get carried away with it, you might hurt yourself. What is the meaning of the verb run up? When you accumulate a number of debts. Resulting in a total debt of a certain amount, you run up a bill for that amount. Giving my son a credit card was a mistake he ran up a $2,500 bill in only one month. What is the meaning of the verb run up, to? When you run to a higher level or place, you run up or run up to that place. Run up and answer the phone if it rings, okay. What is the meaning of the verb blow out? When a piece of electrical equipment or a fuse blows out. It fails because too much electricity is passing through it. When lightning hit our house, it blew all the telephones out. What is the meaning of the verb beat up informal? When you beat people up, you hit them or kick them repeatedly. Timmy got beaten up at school today. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, you arrive. When the vehicle you are in gets in or gets into a place, it arrives. Come in is similar to get in. I'll be waiting for you at the station when your train gets into the station.
What is the meaning of the verb lock up? When you lock people up, you put them in prison. The police locked Hank up after they caught him shoplifting. What is the meaning of the verb kick out, of? When you kick people out or kick people out of a group. Place, building, room, and so on, you order them to leave. Throw out is similar to kick out. Bob's in our carpool, but he's always arguing with the other guys about something. So we're going to kick him out. What is the meaning of the verb gross out and formal? When something grosses you out, it upsets you or makes you sick because you think it is disgusting. You had to dissect a cadaver in your biology class. Yuck, that would have really grossed me out. What is the meaning of the verb give out? To. When you distribute something to other people, you give it out or give it out to them. Hand out is similar to give out. The aid workers would have given more food out to the famine victims, but they didn't have enough. What is the meaning of the verb gross out and formal? When something grosses you out, it upsets you or makes you sick because you think it is disgusting.
Alex hates changing his little brother's diapers it grosses him out. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in trouble or get into a difficult situation or a mess, a eh? mess is a confused or difficult situation, you become involved in it. When you get people in trouble or get them into a difficult situation or a mess. You cause them to become involved in it. Susie got in a lot of trouble at school today. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get something in or get something into a place, building, room, container. enclosure, and so on, you get the object inside even though it is difficult. How did they get that elephant into its cage? What is the meaning of the verb give out, on? When a mechanical or electrical device stops working, it gives out or gives out on you. When a supply of something is completely used, it gives out or gives out on you. The explorers tossed their way in the desert and died after their water gave out. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, building, club. restaurant, meeting, and so on, you obtain permission to enter. When you get other people in or get other people into a building.
club, restaurant, meeting, and so on, you arrange for them to enter. We'll never get into that club, we don't know the right people. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix two things up, you confuse them with each other. Newborn babies sometimes get mixed up in the hospital. What is the meaning of the verb mix up? When you mix two things up, you confuse them with each other. Newborn babies sometimes get mixed up in the hospital. What is the meaning of the verb piss off informal and offensive to some people? When you make people angry, you piss them off. You'd better stop that. You're pissing me off. What is the meaning of the verb piss off informal and offensive to some people? When you make people angry, you piss them off. You'd better stop that. You're pissing me off. What is the meaning of the verb piss off informal and offensive to some people? When you make people angry, you piss them off. Don't make a lot of noise when Mark is trying to study, it pisses him off.
What is the meaning of the verb piss off informal and offensive to some people? When you make people angry, you piss them off. Don't make a lot of noise when Mark is trying to study, it pisses him off. What is the meaning of the verb rip off informal? When you rip people off, you steal something from them, cheat them. Or charge them more money for something than it is worth. Don't do business with Marvin, he rips everyone off. Hank got ripped off by the drug dealer. What is the meaning of the verb rip off informal? When you rip people off, you steal something from them, cheat them. Or charge them more money for something than it is worth. Don't do business with Marvin, he rips everyone off. Hank got ripped off by the drug dealer. What is the meaning of the verb stress out informal? When people or things stress you out, they make you worried, nervous, or tense. Having that new manager around watching me all the time is stressing me out. What is the meaning of the verb stress out informal? When people or things stress you out, they make you worried, nervous, or tense. Having that new manager around watching me all the time is stressing me out.
What is the meaning of the verb stress out informal? When people or things stress you out, they make you worried, nervous, or tense. Sally's sister has to take care of quadruplets all day without any help. That must stress her out. What is the meaning of the verb stress out informal? When people or things stress you out, they make you worried, nervous, or tense. Sally's sister has to take care of quadruplets all day without any help. That must stress her out. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you turn down an electrical or mechanical device. You change the controls to decrease the level of what it is producing or doing. Turn up is the opposite of turn down. Could you turn the radio down? I'm trying to sleep. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you turn down an electrical or mechanical device. You change the controls to decrease the level of what it is producing or doing. Turn up is the opposite of turn down. Could you turn the radio down? I'm trying to sleep. What is the meaning of the verb turn down?
when you turn down an electrical or mechanical device. You change the controls to decrease the level of what it is producing or doing. Turn up is the opposite of turn down. If it gets too cold, I'll turn down the air conditioner. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you turn down an electrical or mechanical device. You change the controls to decrease the level of what it is producing or doing. Turn up is the opposite of turn down. If it gets too cold, I'll turn down the air conditioner. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you deny a request, you turn down the request or turn down the person who has made the request. L asked Nancy to go to the dance with me, but she turned me down. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you deny a request, you turn down the request or turn down the person who has made the request. L asked Nancy to go to the dance with me, but she turned me down. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you deny a request, you turn down the request or turn down the person who has made the request. My request for a pay raise was turned down. What is the meaning of the verb turn down?
when you deny a request, you turn down the request or turn down the person who has made the request. My request for a pay raise was turned down. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you deny a request, you turn down the request or turn down the person who has made the request. Getting turned down every time I apply for a job is getting me down. What is the meaning of the verb turn down? When you deny a request, you turn down the request or turn down the person who has made the request. Getting turned down every time I apply for a job is getting me down. What is the meaning of the verb turn in, to? When you inform the police that certain people have committed crimes or tell the police where they are. You turn them in or turn them in to the police. The escaped prisoner got tired of running and turned himself in. What is the meaning of the verb turn in, to? When you inform the police that certain people have committed crimes or tell the police where they are. You turn them in or turn them in to the police. The escaped prisoner got tired of running and turned himself in. <laughs>